A ye e and then ne. A ye and then ne. All right, one, two, three. That was a good clap. There oh, you go. That hurt me. <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome to the first Beats to Go podcast. My name is Danny. My name's Tony. And yeah, this is gonna be a cool podcast experiment thing we got going on of two musicians, Christians in Houston based, Hispanic. A lot of similarities between me and this guy. Um that we got going on and we just wanna talk about whatever we want. Yeah, so um it, we just we had this idea to make a podcast because it was like it, i don't know like we have an interesting point of view here at houston like yeah as musicians in houston uh playing in different churches every now and then like it, we get an interesting view and experiences yeah. on a lot of things and we're not we're not just going to talk about like musical stuff but we'd also like to talk about like you know personal life things and, and you know funny mm-hmm. stories here and there just kind of make it something entertaining yes. to listen to while you're in traffic or something, on, I don't on, know. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> it's it's literally just gonna be me and him talking about different topics, about different things uh, that we got going on, which sounds really weird. Um, but we're both musicians. We both come from two very similar yet different places, and I don't know. It could be something really cool, and that's an idea that we've been having for like a while now. Yeah. And I don't know. It it, it seemed really cool. Um. So at the moment, this is uh. You're probably gonna be hearing this on YouTube. Um, yes. If you are hearing this on rather Spotify, I the iTunes podcast, SoundCloud, or stuff like that, um, that is because uh, later in time we had put the we had put this on there. For right now, this is solely going to be based on YouTube. Yeah. Um, yeah, we're just gonna put it on YouTube for now, just to kind of start it out. Uh, there's a few details that we still need to fix to get it into iTunes and podcasts and Spotify. But uh, but yeah, for now we'll have it on YouTube and just to kind of get it started and get our followers going and and yeah, yeah. It, we we would have waited and done other stuff, but we're it really excited. Yeah, but we're really excited <laughs> and we wanted to start this like now. No man. And I feel I feel like if we hadn't start this now, we would have never like done it before. You know, because we would always yeah. be putting it back and everything. Like it took yeah, like, like, like oh, y- you guys uh, don't understand how long it took us to be in this room right now. Right now, like that's hilarious. Th- th- this is such like this is a big process. You kept in the making. texting me, Danny. You yeah. kept texting me. You're like, dude, let's do this podcast, dude. Let's do this podcast. I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah dude, let's do, let's do it, let's do it. And I keep I keep getting busy. Then you got busy and stuff. And yeah, it was just hard. Yeah, it was. I mean, but that's another thing about where both of us are always busy or like most of the time busy right yeah. now. We have a bit of free time left over just because it's like Christmas break. We're both out of college. We don't have that many gigs coming yeah. up, you know, and it's you like... Go to, you go to HBU, right? Yeah, I go to Houston Baptist University. I go Huskies. Woof. <laughs> <laughs> totally cutting that out. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I go to U of H, University of Houston. I go Cougs. Cougs. Uh-huh. Right. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so this will be, this will be something fun to start. Um... We'll see. We'll see how it ends up going. Know. You know, something yeah. to try out, kind of. Yeah. For obvious reasons, there. this is just like an introduction type of thing because, even though for the most part, a lot of these are gonna be a lot of the first viewers are gonna be some of our friends and stuff. Hi, friends. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, but eventually, we would, there there are gonna be people that don't know who we are and are listening. Like, who are these two weirdos just talking about random yeah. crap? Like, what the heck? Yeah. Uh, but we do want to see where this is going and this we do want to make this a really cool and fun project that would be i don't know just awesome to do yeah um, and so this is our first episode yeah I this mean, is first something very informal i guess to what it'll actually end up being yeah. it'll still be very chill i think i would yeah. say but um but yeah still introducing ourselves and kind of who we are mm-hmm. do you want to talk about yourself like kind of what you do and who, who you are um yeah uh, my name's danny i like long walks on the beach okay. uh that dates not what i meant oh okay <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait! No, sure. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Go for it. Go for it. Yeah. Wait, this isn't for eHarmony. Wait, what? No. <laughs> this is the wrong podcast, buddy. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Oh, we're gonna get sued. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> nah. Um. For a note. Um. Yeah. We already talked a bit about ourselves, but uh. Yeah. And I'm Danny. I've said that for the fifth time already. Um. I'm. 
I don't know. How do you explain yours? That is kind of weird to introduce <laughs> yeah, yourself. Yeah, it's, I it's think because because we, we already we already said like you know we're like what who we kind of are, but like yeah. saying person. I don't know. L- let me. You know. Yeah. You know how in elementary or like in the first day of school, like though even in high school and stuff like that, but they'll always tell you like, all right, stand up, say your name, and like your favorite thing to do. Yeah. yeah that yeah. was the most nervous like Same. moment Same. I've ever had in school because I never knew what to say because I was like, Same. well, I don't know what I. Yeah. What, like how to introduce myself yeah and you always felt like you were gonna say something stupid or like yeah. you didn't know or like People especially me because i used to i used to be terrible at public speaking if you don't know me i'm, I'm pretty good at public speaking um or at least <laughs> or at least speaking towards the public um <laughs> um but um but when i was in school it would be such like it would be terrible so whenever the teacher goes okay um stand up and um and say your name and about yourself and i'd be like um uh, my name is um Via real Dan- I mean Daniel. I I I I like turtles and like I, I never knew what to yeah. say. Oh. Yeah, I always found myself in those weird positions, but it was funny because like once you start growing and like during high school, like you already know most yeah, of the people yeah, that are in your yeah, class. Yeah. So it's like, so whenever they tell you to introduce yourself, typically it's like told with the teacher, yeah. and like you'll say something funny and hilarious, and like everybody else will laugh. Yeah, everybody, like, everybody, yeah. everybody, everybody would be, them, everybody right? be like, like oh, inside joke, inside joke. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I but, definitely don't miss high school though. Oh, I know I keep saying that. Yeah, I definitely do yeah. not miss high school. Hi, at all. High school, at least towards me, it was fun. It was awesome. Totally do not miss it. Yeah, I prefer. I always hear like how I am people right saying now. like when you become an adult, like enjoy your childhood because like you're never gonna experience it again and all that. And I was like, yeah, yeah like that's cool yeah. at a certain point, but I definitely don't miss high school. Yeah, though. right now I'm I'm pretty chill being a, a yeah. college intellectual. Yeah, oh, <laughs> but as the but yeah, I'm, I, college one, is so it, much it's, better. It's awesome. Like so obvious, much uh, for, for obvious reasons, like the classes are harder and stuff like that. Yeah, but, but when it comes to like, I mean, as long as you have all your things together, and as long as you you know what you're doing, and as long as you're not slacking around, or yeah, you know, as as long as you're a nerd, basically, you're <laughs> like you're, no. you're you're fine. I mean, I because mean, no. I, I had the opportunity to graduate with an associate degree. During high school, he did. So, I didn't. Go on. So it was really cool because, like, now in college, like, I'm taking classes that are focused, ba- like, only on what I want to study, which yeah. I'm majoring in mechanical engineering. Um, but it's it's like specifically on that, so it's something that I actually enjoy, like, talking about, or listening mm-hmm. to, or you know, learning about, not yeah. just some random history class. Yeah, because because you you're doing something that like you want, and yeah, like exactly. it's something, and, and like. It's like weird because in high school I remember I I never really cared about the classes I didn't care about and you're you're basically taking all classes you yeah. care about and all things like that, which on my hand I'm just taking my basics right now which, I mean they're basics so they're all like kind of pieces of cake you always have you but you always get that one professor that's like yeah oh my god I want to strangle you right now in class, um, <laughs> um but other but right now I'm just. Yeah, it's 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 going okay. Uh, it's it's, uh, it's just my basic. So it, it feels when it comes to like topics wise, it still kind of feels like high school because it's still yeah, like yeah. your math or English. Yeah, but yeah. then you have little mixes of like the psychology yeah. course or you know and stuff like that. And I'm just and like, you're whoa. basically on your own, dude. Yeah, like teachers are, do not no, care at all. No, no, <laughs> professors no one, don't. Care. No one cares. Like like. First day, of, not, not even the first day of high school, but like you, you really see because like in high school you'd be like in your cliques and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And come the first day, no one cares. Like no one cares what you're wearing. Yeah. Or anything. It's just like <laughs> it's funny seeing people in pajamas and like random dudes. Dude, like that's over there. like in high school, you'd see like the people wearing Jordans and like <laughs> freaking. Well, yeah, I was never a big fan of Jordans, but you, you know. What I mean? Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's definitely, it's definitely better than high school yeah, though you, you see all these kids you know all these girls with them cake faces over here cake faces <laughs> <laughs> bro oh my god like i would have girls in my school that would come with makeup like mm, like you could cut it like <laughs> like like so i'm serious you say that one yeah. time that was funny yeah like you, you like you could like put a blade down there and like do a little cross section like to see the layers of the lasagna right there no like but oh my god yeah um so uh, into the whole stuff that we do, actually, the reason why we know each other is, um, uh, well, do, oh, I'll talk about it. Um, <laughs> there's this okay. school. Should we name the school? I don't know if we should. I don't think because my, 
uh, legal reasons. Yeah, I don't know if it's legal or yeah. not. See, this is how you know that we're new at this. How about yeah, we're, we're, okay. we're, very, we're very new at this. So just know when we when we say we're gonna story, be careful with yeah, names. we're going to be very careful with names. Yeah, um, and very things in it. So we went, to, we went to a school called the Song Institute. No, oh. don't, don't say that. <laughs> that just sounds like a lame school now. No, okay, I mean, it was but, a school. Okay, but, that, but that's, that's okay. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah. a school that um, it, it's focused on teaching students how to um, learn how to play instruments and kind of in the Christian environment mm-hmm. um, here in Houston. And um, they're, 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 it's a chain school. So it's like school. a Christian yeah. music school, yeah, basically. Kind of, yeah, pretty yeah. much. Um, and, yeah. and like they would teach you how to play instruments, they would teach you music theory, but then they'll yeah. also do like devotionals, uh, and, and teach you about Jesus and kind of like your job as a, as a, mm-hmm. as a worship leader. Um, but, uh, we, we knew each other from there. That's, that's where we met. Okay. Um, but like it was four semesters long, but we didn't know each other's names until yeah, the okay. second semester. <laughs> okay. We have a, there's, okay. So... <laughs> <laughs> we went we went to that music school and when you're you have your class of like people like you're with that's like your band pretty yeah. much it's your ensemble yeah and you're basically you with, stick them with them all for a, yeah, you basically stick with them unless they get out and what i mean by get out is our first semester we had about 30 some people oh my graduating goodness. only six yeah and those six actually were all still pretty tight yeah we are yeah we're all still really cool. Um, for the the boys are, are are more tighter. We miss the girls. Girls, we miss you if you're listening to this. Um, probably not. But, yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Hopefully, you guys Hopefully. are listening to this. Yeah. Um, no, but uh, so we we always uh, at least that first semester. I mean, we were new. It was like our eighth grade year. You went in for bass. I went in for bass. I went in for drums. Mm-hmm. And uh, in our first year, or not first year, our first semester. We didn't know each other's names, like we and knew. It's weird because the yeah. basses and the drummer like know, stick they're, together, they're supposed like, to stick together know? and everything. Yeah, but we would never hang out with each other. Yeah, and you also have to, you guys have to understand at that time we were two very different people. Oh yeah, and then we are like, like I was, I was, I was a. I mean, I'm still pretty chunky, but I was like a, a nerd, <laughs> a little emo kid that like loved watching like. I was just a dork, basically. That was that was my thing going on. I didn't care about sports. I didn't want to do anything. I was just like, I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. While your boy over here was like messy on <laughs> what a soccer boy over here. Yeah, I was very, I was very, I was very athletic back then. Yeah. Um, but yeah, and it it's it's interesting. I I think that whole phase of that music school that we went through, um, was was definitely something that shaped me to be who I am now. It shaped all of us. Yeah, it changes all. Not only us, for us to be to be like like better within ourselves and personal, but also like I don't know, just the, the relationship we had with those people in there. I still have great. We all still have great relationships with those people, and sometimes they're like the people that have our backs most of the times. Yeah, like yeah. this guy right here. You, you, your boy, you can't see. I'm pointing to him. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna yeah, say. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta get used to this. Um, but he, he, he's one of my, if not, he's like, he's my brother at this point. Like, yeah. <laughs> like honestly, like at his house is my second home and everything. <laughs> and we've been together, but it's, but it's so funny to think that our first semester, we didn't even know each other's names, and now that's we're like we're, we're inseparable like it's it's like we're yeah. always like we're together and stuff like it would it would be funny because the first couple of days the first like times we would see each other would be like hey man hey what's bro, up what's bro what's up yeah dude <laughs> yeah so dude i remember one time you were like hey mr beatbox you yeah because you used to beatbox all the time <laughs> i was like i didn't know what else to call you so i was like mr me, yeah. beatbox I thought it was cool, but like you know, I still didn't know your name. <laughs> but uh, but yeah, so we we met each other there. Um, eventually, when we graduated from there, everybody kind of went their own ways. Mm-hmm. But we still all texted each other, right? Mm-hmm. And um, and I I currently play at a church named Lakewood Church. Um, I serve with the kids ministry. I also work there now too, and um, and kind of had Daniel jump in there. He was playing at another church too. Um. Yeah, oh, it's not. Uh, I forgot about the names. <laughs> I was playing. Actually, no. We could, we could say they could. Okay. Okay. Cool. So that's like our home church. Yeah. Thing. 
Late, yeah, 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 and, yeah. But I was playing at a, I was playing at a different place. It wasn't even my home church. It was just somewhere that had invited me at the time. And then uh, one day, you guys uh, were going to oh yeah. West Texas. Yeah, you guys that's were going to go to That's Texas. where we invited you first. <laughs> so we got invited to play at um, some at, event. It was like a, it was like some type of conference. But it was like outside. It, it was tent. outside in in like the middle of nowhere, yeah. all the way in West Texas. Which, yeah. if you don't know, is about nine or ten hours away from Houston, Texas. Yeah. So, like, it was, it was, yeah. it was interesting. It's also nine or um, ten degrees above Houston, Texas. So. <laughs> yeah. Well, Super. you never know Houston. Yeah, Houston, and, uh, Texas in general. I always the say weather. that. Houston, yeah, I always say that in Houston, you'll always, um, you'll experience all four seasons in one week. Dude, honest, not even <laughs> in a day. Past couple hours, it was foggy this morning. Oh and it yeah. It was like hot. Yeah. Like, it's about to get cold that night. Watch. We're in December, and we're experiencing uh, very high highs. <laughs> yeah. Um, that's so weird. But you know what? You know, but just, anyways. Okay. So, West Texas, right? Yeah, yeah, So, yeah. we met there. I mean, well, we invited you there because uh, we needed a basis that day. And so, I was like, oh, well, I know I know somebody that we could invite. Like, he's really cool and everything. Let, let's get him on board. Like, okay, okay, cool. So, we go over there, and he ends up going with us. He played together. He ends up clicking pretty well with all of us. And a couple, I think it was a couple weeks later, we ended up having auditions, right? Yeah. And so I, I told you about it, and and yeah, you ended up auditioning. It was funny because like, during our auditions, uh, which is a really cool process that we could probably talk about later, some on another podcast. Yeah. But um, but there's a question that we also do like an interview question uh, moments, and and when we ask you like, why are you here? And people will typically respond with like, oh, I feel like Jesus is calling me to be here. Like God's calling me to do this and that. Yeah, because you were straight yeah. up with us. You were like. Oh, I'm here because of Tony. Because <laughs> Tony invited me. I think you guys are cool. We played together the other day. I thought it was really cool. <laughs> and I got in. <laughs> and you got in. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah. It's honesty it was true. I mean, but at the, I, because I do, I do remember that. Um, and the the thing about that is, um, I mean, everybody does give those stereotypes, especially yeah. at a church. If if for those that don't understand what a church setting is like. Um, it's you, a lot of the times, a lot of the answers and a lot of things you got to say is it has to be very Jesus and very like religiously orientated. Um, and at the time I was just like, kind of want to be honest. Um, although I do, I still want like to grow spiritually and stuff at this church. I also a big portion why I'm here is cause I really like these cats and they're all really dope and I really like them. Uh, so Yeah. And then when he re- they said, so why why did you come here? I just I just straight up said, oh man, y'all are cool. <laughs> like, <laughs> and yeah. yeah, and I've been with you guys ever since. Yeah, how many years has it been yeah. since you joined the band? Four, four years. It's been a while. Really? It's been a while. How long have I been there? I keep thinking that I've only been there for like five years, but I think I that was about two years ago maybe, that I maybe, thought that. Maybe I don't know. I think I've been there for like seven years. Because you were there before or me. Or six. Because when you were there in the middle of when we were in, in music school, no? Yeah. It was, I got in, I think, during our second semester of, of You did, right? Because you got school. in with our, our, our another friend of ours, Strawberry. Oh, yes. Yeah, 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 yes. Yeah, 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 yes. yeah, we did. He knows who he is. Okay, Strawberry. Yeah, okay, Fresita. Strawberry. Mr. Fresita. <laughs> okay, the more we say his name, the more people are going to ask. Yeah. <laughs> well, eventually we'll start naming most of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If they let well, us. Yeah, once people, once people. Because people don't really even know that we're doing this yeah. right now, actually. Yeah. So this, this will catch people this, by yeah, surprise. No, the, the, only, the only few people that know about this are just our closest yeah, and and when and we we and when we say cl- we mean like our closest. Like, yeah, we didn't really share like, this because we don't. We well, we wanted this to be like kind of like a surprise. Like well, not really a surprise, but we just kind of wanted to show people. Yeah, yeah. So this would be this would be pretty funny. But uh, yeah, so ever yeah. since then we've been playing there, and now we play there all the time, and we and get now, invited to play at different places too. Yes. Uh, we help out other churches mm-hmm. uh, here and there. Um, I think you're playing a lot in time, different churches, especially playing, for this time during the holidays. This time right now, holidays. Christmas time. And it doesn't even matter if you're a Christian musician, any musician, doesn't matter, second, whatever musician you are, if you have an instrument and you do gigs around any area, you know that the holidays are a real work and they <laughs> yeah. hurt you. And by the end of it, you are sick and tired of Christmas music. Oh my. This goes for yes. any vocalist. You know any how many of... how many songs I've played already just this month? How many yes. Christmas songs? Yes. I think it's like about I 30 know. already. Like, like <laughs> honestly, like I'm getting, oh my God, these Christmas music. Like, like I'm, I'm so... I love me Christmas music. I know, I love Christmas it, music, but, yeah. but, but when, when you play it over yeah. and over and 
Yeah. Over again? <laughs> it, 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 it's just, oh, it, 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 not, it doesn't really get annoying. Uh, no, it, it, gets, it gets annoying. Like, you're just like, what the heck? But it's uh, definitely cool. I but think it, but yeah, we I'll, def- I'll, yeah. I'll clear this up, though. We are very, um, what, what's the word? Like, we're very blessed to be dude, doing what dude. we do. Okay, yeah. yeah. Let, me, let, yeah. Me, let me get that out there. Like, este, I am so happy with what I'm doing. Like, yeah, me I'm, too. I'd rather be doing this than a nine to five or something like that. Cause yeah, like it's it's pretty good. You know, you you you're doing what you're doing, and I'm doing what I love. Yeah, and that's what's that's what most important. And I'm very blessed. Though, just because it's your dream job, doesn't mean it's like all fun and games. Though it's still a job. Like you, the people will still have gripes about it. And it, and for musicians, it's yeah. a little different. Yeah, you have yeah. your moments. Yeah, yeah. you have your moments. And one of our moments in December is. Christmas music. <laughs> yeah. So it gets really busy. I know. But it's all definitely worth it. I think yeah, I enjoy it really this so is, much. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's a lot yeah. of, it's a lot of, it's a, it, is, it is a lot of work, but it's also an immense amount of fun. Oh, we recently, uh, we played at the Pearland Town Center here yeah. in Pearland, Pearland, mm-hmm. Texas. That, that was funny. That was, that was fun. That was an interesting. It was interesting. Inter- for the people that know you yeah. were there and that are listening, you guys know how interesting it was. <laughs> I Basi- mean, basically, I mean, I don't know. It was just, it was weird. We base, it's a shopping, the Pearland Town Center is a shopping mall, yeah. but it's in like an outlet mall. And so they have this part in the center where there's like a big Christmas tree and then they have like this huge um, uh, cover tent, not a tent, I don't know what it's called, like a gazebo type of thing. And um, and yeah, like we just had live music playing. We were just supposed to be there for like live music entertainment while people were walking by so we, we weren't really like the main attraction mm-hmm. but um we were, mo- we were most likely background music but i feel like everybody expected at least yeah more the rest pe- of the guys kind of expected for, for more. more people to yeah not necessarily more but for more people to care yeah uh, but at the same time you also have to just, we're, they're at the mall they're yeah, just trying to get their mall. shopping yeah. they're just doing we're just background music yeah. so a lot of the time although, although even though it's the, we didn't get as much as the audience you would like to get um it was, it was still it was still experience. fun and you yeah. know it, gave, it actually gave us a lot of flexibility to do a lot of things that were offset and a lot of things that we wanted to do and a lot of yeah. fun uh, things that we, we got we, experiences that we got to do and the food that we ate after that oh, oh. we went to uh, yeah. texas roadhouse we went, and we, we mm. i know yeah <laughs> this we, is not a paid advertisement <laughs> this is not a but but texas roadhouse if you guys want to uh <laughs> send us send us a couple steaks oh, over man. i will i will be glad with that um, yeah, that was that was something, that was, and that was actually a lot of fun too. You know how big our bill was? Did I ever tell you? Yeah, you did. It was it was it was a big bill. It was pretty big. It was it, it was, was. How many of us were there? Like uh, seven, seven people. Eight? eight by the end. Probably. I think it was like eight because Josh ended up joining yeah. later. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Josh is one of our friends. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Oh, geez, that scared me. <laughs> Watch, he doesn't cut any of this out and just are the people just leave. leaves everything <laughs> in there <laughs> like that. And, the, and the claps are still there and oh like, man it's oh. gonna cut someone's ears in case he did cut it um we, we clapped and that's how we know that you had to cut something though yeah just 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 for some it's it's our first thing and we gotta be we, we're not necessarily careful but we just gotta you know, we want to we want to seem cool <laughs> <laughs> yeah we want to seem like we know what we're doing yeah. <laughs> we want to see that we know at least something you know yeah. Um, what else could we talk about? Oh man, don't don't. I've never heard a podcast. Yet. What else can we talk? About? <laughs> <laughs> we're, okay, we're so unprepared for this. <laughs> kind of. We oh, have man. notes that we're passing to each other right now yeah, on our phones, and so we it's, can. It's it's it's. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's working. It's going it's, there. It's getting there. Yeah. Um, but um, are we are we gonna say our sponsors? <laughs> no, we can't. We don't okay. have actual sponsors. <laughs> they count. I mean, I, at the end, I think we could just shout ourselves out. Like, who we'll shout ourselves? I mean, yeah, that. okay, yeah, and yeah. <laughs> We're Eventually. sponsored by Seeky. No, Seeky. <laughs> Thank you, Seeky. Thank you, Seeky. Um, <laughs> <laughs> We're totally cutting this out. <laughs> we cannot put that. Oh away. man. Um, oh, uh, we're both very tired. Uh, yeah. It's been a it's been while a tiring for month, us. But it's been a very tiring month, like we said, December. Um, but it's a lot of fun. But we also get, uh, this is a lot of also sleepless nights type of tired, which is actually kind of fun because, you know, we're, we're, we're doing whatever we want. Not that, well, not whatever we want, but, you know, we're, we're having fun. Yeah, we're, now that school is over, dude, you know, I've young. been so much more chill. Like, yeah. 
my mom, my, it, I don't even know why or how it happened, but my mom had the great idea to buy us an Xbox, surprisingly enough. And, and a little, and, little context to that. Uh, we're not gamers. Yeah, we don't play games at <laughs> we all. Don't, we don't. We don't. That's that's like not our thing. Yeah, but it's I think, still, but it's still fun. <laughs> yeah, for sure. I took it. I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> let's do it. So we got FIFA going on in there. Just, that that one night, I think you and Aaron and and who else came over? It was just y'all two, right? Yeah, yeah. And we you were and we were in my backyard playing, playing. FIFA till like four in the morning, and it was yeah. quite, kind of chilly, so it was yeah. really nice. Yeah, so it was, it was cold. We had blankets yeah. on. It, where you're just okay, it sound kind of something else, but it, it it was really fun, you know. Just like I don't know, I feel like other people have these like like stories, like oh, we play video games and it, but we don't have that. <laughs> this yeah. is like cool to us. Oh, which, <laughs> I know, which is weird world. <laughs> I know it's a whole new world. My phone. And you just so. dropped your phone. Good one. I, <laughs> we're, we're, we're cutting that out. We'll cut that out. <laughs> uh, Let, let's just cut out the whole podcast at this point. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, well, no, I think. But, I think we got about 30 minutes in already. Do we have about 30 minutes? About, yeah. About. We, spent, we spent most of the time just introducing ourselves. Yeah. It was a lot of fun. It's fine though. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you still have a lot, a lot of other things, but this is, I don't know, this is, this, this is going to be, this is going to be an, an, an interesting experience. Again, we're just, we're just trying to sell. We're, we're just, we're honestly just two guys that are, be, are best friends that, I don't know, we just want to, we'll, we, we have a lot of silly conversations in our car. And that's where yeah. a lot of this stemmed from, where we have we have a lot of like meaningful, deep, silly, whatever conversations in our car, and for and we had the grand idea of being like, we should uh we should actually re- record this, you know yeah. maybe maybe there's some content that we're saying out here yeah. maybe somebody would would like to listen. Yeah, I'd Even, like for this to be something that'll help help somehow. I think either help someone change their life or help someone get through traffic in a yeah, more yeah, entertaining you know, way. You know yeah, what I mean? We, we can uh, make you cry. We can make you laugh anything you want. Like we're, we're here. For yeah. You. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, but yeah, this is the first episode. I mean, we've basically spent the whole time just kind of introducing ourselves just, just yeah. to kind of set the, yeah. the standard, set the yeah. base. And of, you know, of we who talk, we are. and even then, like we we didn't really introduce ourselves, but later on, you guys will know who we are. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so. And if you already know who we are, What's up? <laughs> but uh, but yeah, should we close it? I mean, should we close it here? Is that what it is? Do we are we are we closing it? Is that is that what's is happening? that what's happening? We're, yeah. we're closing our first podcast. <laughs> I think so. This is a big deal. You don't understand the build up to this. This is there oh. is there is an immense build up to this. It's it's. We forgot to talk about our outro. Should we have an outro? How do, would we do you end want our an outro? Podcast? I mean, we could just have the outro as an intro. Okay, we, we're planning on having an outro and an uh, I mean an intro. We're planning on having one. Um, it's just a matter of recording it and, and yeah. getting it all together. Um, so maybe in, in in a couple episodes, not 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 too far, um, but in a few, um, you you'll you'll hear it and it'll be really cool. Um, so yeah, man, thanks so, for listening. Uh, this is the Beats to Go podcast. The Beats to Go. I'm Tony. Go, 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 go. And I'm Danny. <laughs> and thanks for listening. Yeah, thanks for watching. No, listening. Oh, not watching. This. Yeah. <laughs> thanks. All right. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> That was funny.